Let's see if there's still arsenic in protein shakes or protein drinks, which are very popular um, with both young and old these days. But uh, how safe are they? We're going to use the test safe arsenic detector. And let me proceed by taking the contents out of its pack. It's a single use product. There is a detector and a medicine dropper that comes with it. Um, and a packet of solution. I'm going to first take this packet solution out, unscrew this cap, lay it on a flat surface, being careful to include the filter paper later. And I will make a cut here on this solution and eyeball a drop into the cap. We'll need to keep this for two minutes. So we can start to do our test. I will put the filter paper back onto the cap here and pour an amount of the shake into the detector up to the mark here. And then, with the filter paper back on, screwing the cap, and now we will wait for 30 minutes. I have here a chart to see if there is any um, arsenic present in the sample. and. Uh, the color will tell us how much arsenic uh, there is in the sample. I'm going to unscrew the cap and take a look. The result shows there is very little arsenic. Uh, the discoloration that you can see here in the detector cap is very faint. I would estimate it in the 2 to 5 parts per billion. Um, doesn't mean the sample or the protein shake or powder you use doesn't have it, but it will be well for you to test for your own safety and peace of mind whether there is uh, enough arsenic present to constitute a, uh, a hazard for you.